Who's your fa- who's your favorite stand up, Rhea? Oh, or, 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 or who was it? Who was who was your big? Who, who, who was your hero that made you want to be a stand up? Um. Well, honestly, this is going to be so cliche, but Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I watched I her when I was like a kid. I wouldn't have it any other way. Yeah, I mean, it's perfect. <laughs> Did you and Tig uh, go and see her a lot? Yeah, yeah. We like held hands, watched it. And we're like, this is great, right? Yeah. So, should we take the homobile to Ellen's concert? <laughs> yeah, let's take the homobile. <laughs> I actually I remember Elle, when I was a kid I was like, I thought Ellen was very like plucky and fun and funny mm-hmm. and that was before she became a, a an icon of controversy slash progress slash whatever. Yeah, I mean uh, she was a solid she is a solid stand up comedian. Yeah, I mean, she's certainly because her contemporaries humor, not to throw him too much under the bus but her contemporaries were Rita Rudner. Um, actually, Paula Poundstone was r- really mm-hmm. funny. Did you did you ever watch Paula Poundstone's show on HBO? Did you ever see that? I feel like I did. Yeah. I don't know. She just had regular people up 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 and talk to them. That was a, that was a, a, she would have like firemen and like dentists and stuff. She yeah. would really, like 